Bipolar disorder in grand part is inheritable. There are studies, enough studies across the world, both in children and in adults, who are showing the one in running families. Now, not because an illness running families means that it is genetic, though. However, there are studies showing, for example, in identical twins. If one twin, for example, is who is at risk for bipolar, who are raised in different environments, and if one twin gets the bipolar, there is almost like 70%, 80% chances that the other twin also will develop bipolar, even if they are in different environments. Then these kind of studies are showing that definitely there is a com genetic component, a large genetic component in bipolar. Now, like everything in life, not everything is genetic. There is an interaction. There is a combination of effects of having the genes plus the environment. There are very few illnesses that is only genetics, like for example, Huntington. But the rest of the illness, like cardiovascular illness, diabetes and everything, is a combination of genes and the environment. For example, if I have the genes for diabetes, but I'm not a couch potato and I am doing exercise and I keep my diet, maybe I will die and no one will know that I have the genes for diabetes. I think we think it's similar, a little bit more complex, but it's similar in mental illnesses, in most of mental illnesses.